City Hydro Farm is tucked away inside a Baltimore City row home, a space with no land, soil, or sunlight. Confused? Well, just wait until you see what's behind the door. The root system, nice and white, perfect. The borge is almost there, another day or so, and it'll be ready. Here in this 10 by 15 foot room, Larry and Jana Hounce grow 85 varieties of microgreens. We set up racks in here and then started putting the trays in it. Trays of borage, fennel, red cabbage, arugula, lemon sorrel, leeks, and cilantro, just to name a few. The cilantro turned out very nice. Look at that cilantro. The practice of producing food in stacked layers is known as vertical farming. Everything is on shelving or everything is running up and down instead of flat on the ground. This method of farming is something Larry considered only after he was in a serious car accident and couldn't keep working as a cybersecurity consultant. At first, it seemed unlikely he could raise enough greens to make a living. Twenty, thirty dollars worth of lettuce wasn't going to pay the bills. And my wife kept saying to me the whole time, Larry, microgreens, you got to think about microgreens. So he started to experiment with microgreens. On average, they can go from seed to harvest in about a week. We use 100% organic coconut fiber. We use bamboo sticks to lift up the coconut fiber so we actually have a true hydroponic operation going. And we use the same conventional seeds that the farmers use. We use pure water. We don't mix any chemicals together, so it's all very, very simple. This entire room uses about five gallons of water a day. That's one cup of water per tray. We grow roughly 70 trays of microgreens a week for the local restaurants. Larry sells the microgreens with roots attached, so chefs can harvest as they need them. So therefore, they're getting the full bang for the buck, per se, when it comes to flavor and nutritional value. It only costs about $6 to grow a tray of greens, and that includes electricity. Larry designed his own energy-efficient LED lights to keep costs down, and it's worked. The farm's electric bill is only about $125 a month. These lights produce little to no heat whatsoever, and they run on 12 volts. That means these nutritious greens also bring in a healthy profit. New York City, the trays sell for $100. Delaware, it's $75. In Baltimore here, we sell our trays for $30. And now that the Hounces have perfected their method, they're selling their system. We have 35 plus growers around the world. In the United States, we're in California, we're in Orlando, Florida, New York City. I think we have six or eight right here in Baltimore alone. That means plenty of fresh microgreens to enjoy. Larry, you have put together a beautiful plate. Yeah, so this is actually a bouquetier of fresh vegetables with a balsamic vinegar and sugar and a roasted red pepper coulis. And lots of uh, microgreens from right upstairs to finish it off. From right upstairs. So let's go ahead and I'll start putting them on the plate here. We have some lemon sorrel right there. Mm -hmm. We'll put on some borage that has an amazing cucumber flavor to it. What's that one? This one here is red cabbage. Uh -huh. And then we have some fresh arugula. We just harvested it upstairs in our garden. This arugula tastes unbelievable. It is so intense. And just a little bit of it filled my mouth with flavor. It's amazing. We're going to put this recipe on our website at mpt.org farm. You can try it at home.